Hey everybody, Ken Surf's here and it's time for another shaving video. I hope you guys have uh, had a good week. I haven't seen you since Super Bowl. Uh, great game by the way and I was very happy with the results. But uh, man, it was coming down to the uh, final few seconds, right? Final few minutes. Good game though. All right, we're back in the shave den as I said and we are going to be trying out a new item today. This one is from Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements and it is a scuttle. It is the Dreamscape Scuttle from PAA. There we go, their logo's on the bottom. Now, if you've watched the channel, you'll know that uh, I'm no stranger to using scuttles. I've got, I use shave bowls, I use uh, scuttles all the time. In fact, my wife got me this a few years ago, and I don't think uh, Diego Scuttles in San Diego is still in business, but uh, I, I use this uh, quite a bit. There we go, that's the 007 one. Well. With most of these scuttles, the uh, they have like indentations uh, to help whip up the lather. Still got some uh, old soap in there. What's cool about the the new Dreamscape scuttle, man, I'm gonna get tongue tied. Dreamscape scuttle is that it has the vents come up. They don't have like the indentations. They have like raised vents, so that's pretty cool. Comes with a cork. And I guess it holds, I think, 16 ounces of uh, water. So what's cool about that is you get it full of water, and when you start lathering, your lather's warm. So you kind of got a, a, a hot towel shave almost. So we're going to see how this works today. And, uh, yeah, another scuttle from the UK. Uh, and brush set. At least these ones, you kind of soak your uh, brush in them. But... Uh, this one is a little different. So looking forward to trying it. Let's set this away. And I'm gonna turn on the hot water for a few seconds and fill this scuttle up. Oh, All right, I've got the hot water in it now. And let's cork that. Man, the whole bowl is nice and hot. So we're gonna see, it. We're gonna see how it does. All right, uh, can you tell I need to shave? I'm using uh, the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements uh, Double Open Comb Beast today with the uh, cool vintage red tip. So I'll be using that. And I'm gonna also use one of the PAA's blades. Uh, soap though is gonna be from Sterling Soap Company, Satsuma. And it is a really nice, oh, just very fresh fruit scent. They've got, uh, I think, oranges on there. Smells very good, very good, very good. And I'm gonna top that off with uh, Island Thyme, which is, we've got the fruit and the pineapple scent. Uh, we're gonna be using that from Captain's Choice and from Omega Brushes, the Evo Brush. In fact, let's get this into the crystal skull and we'll get this shave started. Enough talk, right? All right, I've already loaded the blade, as you can see in the uh, in the DOC razor. I don't know if this one's in stock again. This is one of their best-selling razors, I'm told, and it's hard to come by. I'm very happy to have mine, and every once in a while I bring it out to mow down the uh, mow down the the beard, and hopefully not get cut. Okay, got the British fifty pence piece. There's lots of ways you can do this. You can. Uh, bowl or you can face lash. lots of ways you can load the scuttle i'm gonna put the soap on it some people load up the brush first in the uh container the soap came in and then they bring it into the scuttle and do it i'm gonna just put the soap directly into the scuttle i was watching mark uh, mark's video and he has done a review on the scuttle uh, he did a head shave with it, and uh, it seemed to work pretty good for him. I, I, I like watching uh, other people's videos after I do mine, so it doesn't look like I'm plagiarizing. All right, now I've set down my brush. Oh, ends the crystal skull. <laughs> I've been out mowing the lawn, the back lawn, and man, I got it's dusty and pollen everywhere. Oh, man. So I got a feeling my allergies are going to kick up a bit. All right. Lather is thickening. 
See that? You can hear the water. Now, a cool feature that uh, the Diego Scuttles had is they had a little hole inside the uh, ceramic bowl, a little bit above the water level, a little bit. And what they could do is you could just do a little flip and it brings some water into the bowl. So that way you could uh, reload your, your brush easier and add a little more water if needed. I didn't use it all the time, but man, look at that. You don't see Ken Surf whipping up lather like that all the time, right? <laughs> In fact, it's usually so thin you can't even tell I got lather on my face. All right. Oh, it is nice and warm right away. Oh, nice and warm. Guys, you might as well spoil yourself, man. If you're doing a shave, it's really cool being warm, <laughs> hot. It's really cool being hot, all right. Duh, can all right. Wow. It's usually sheer laziness that I'm not using a scuttle every day. Because I'm filming. All right. Oh, mow it down, baby. Mow it down. Very nice. Very nice. My wife's friend, uh, Stella, her sons have now uh, gotten into wet shaving and her husband. So uh, I'm giving them, I gave him some extra stuff and uh, giving them some pointers. So, uh, you know, it does save you a lot of money and it, it is it is kind of a cool hobby, wet shaving. Uh, went out and spent the night over at a girlfriend's house hanging out, you know, with the family and uh, it kind of gave me a break. So uh, I've taken my dog, Monty. And if you watch the channel, you'll hear Monty in the background a lot. Took him in for, he's like 11. Brittany, he's 11. Brittany Spaniel, he's 11. And we went in. I thought he was going deaf, I'm going to be honest with you. And the vet says his hearing's perfect. He's just choosing to ignore you in his old age. So uh, uh, we got a good, good review for Mr. Monty. So last night I took him through the drive through of Del Taco and I got him a beef burrito and uh, I got a beef burrito and we sat down and we watched, uh, started binge watching The Peacemaker on, uh, uh, I think it's on Prime. Anyway, The Peacemaker. The Suicide Squad sequel, I guess. Man, it is thick. I think I mentioned in the past, I have a good buddy who uses this razor only, every day, all year long, this razor, and he just tries out different blades. And... All right. Loves it. Oh, man, the lather is still hot. And I think this is coming in uh, price-wise. I think it was listed at 50, but it's like 34 or something. Uh, it, it, it's got a, they've got a sale going on. I've got a link inside the, the description of this video if you're interested. <laughs> I 
That's some lather. Okay. Very, very happy with this. Very happy with this. All right. Got some sun outside, I see. <laughs> it's uh, like low 70s today. It was like 85 last week. The weirdest weather. Yeah, I definitely got some sun. Okay. Island time. My favorite part of the shave. Oh. And that's why. Oof, oof, oof. There's a burn on top of the sunburn. <laughs> no cuts. You know, it is a testimonial to the soap, uh, the blade, when a beast like that, uh, and I was just kind of going for it. You know, I wasn't really taking my time. Uh, if you can survive without a nick, that's, a, that's good. So the bowl, the scuttle, whipping that soap up, that hot soap, perfect. All right, I'm very happy with that. Very happy with the results. Way to go, Douglas. You did good, buddy. All right, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I do look forward to seeing you all again very soon. Have a great President's Weekend. Yay, Monday off. And uh, I look forward to doing another shave with you very, very soon. Bye for now. Stay safe.